Hello students, my name is Larry Bergeson, Superintendent of Washington County School District, and I'd like to take this opportunity to visit with you for just a few minutes about the current events and situation that we're going through relative to the coronavirus. Let me reference a few things in my past that can give us a reference point. In 1963, President John F. Kennedy was assassinated. That was a traumatic situation in my life and everyone's life at that point. I was seven years old. Following that, in 1975, the Vietnam War ended. I was then a junior in high school and looking to possibly have to sign up for the draft. That was a significant time and event in my life again. Following that, in 1986, we had the Space Shuttle Challenger explode, killing all seven crew members on board, including a teacher. I watched that with the classroom uh, full of students. Then you can move on to the events of 9-11 in 2001 when terrorists took down the Twin Towers. That was another tragic event that affected everybody in the world for that matter and especially in the United States. Then look at today, the coronavirus, in unprecedented ways it's affecting us. Uh, shutting down activities, events, of course closing school, businesses and other things. This is something that you're dealing with on a daily basis. We're asking you to do several things you're normally not doing, and that is to be remotely educated, to get up, establish different routines. My advice to you would be to do just that. Establish habits and routines that get you through your day. Do your schoolwork at certain times. Do your activities at certain times. And socialize at certain times. Either way, you've got to establish habits and routines that will get you through the day. Don't get stressed about grades or meeting graduation requirements. The important thing that we ask that you do is just try. Do your very best. Communicate with your teachers. As long as you're trying, doing your best, we're going to be reasonable and we'll make things work. Perhaps some of you are wondering about graduation or state tournaments at the end of a school year. As far as graduation is concerned, we're going to do something that will recognize each of you graduates. I'm not sure it'll be exactly like the traditional graduations as we don't know what the conditions will allow us to do, but we will do something to recognize you. And as far as state tournaments or culminating events from the Utah High School Activities Association for Spring Sports, they're looking at options and modifications they can make to still hold those tournaments for all of those spring sports. And lastly, I would like to encourage each of you, aside from taking care of yourselves, to look for opportunities to reach out and help others, family members, friends, neighbors. Just be there for each other, to support each other, and to help all of us get through this, and everything will work out just fine.